What's going on everyone? It's Adam here from Adam's Nintendo World and GamesReviews.com with a extra special live stream on a Thursday night, which I don't normally do, but I'm playing Mario Kart 8 Deluxe with my wife. And I'm really actually looking forward to beating her pretty bad at it. Want to do a quick shout out to all of our Patreon supporters. Carmelo, Gladiator, Aurora, Andrew, Shiznets, Kyrie, Alexis, Holly, Marge, Taylor, Amila, and Ada. Thank you all so much for your generous donations to the channel. If someone can let me know if the audio is good, because we're sharing a mic, and I don't know how that's going to work out. Um, hopefully it works out just fine. We are both going to play as Yoshi in the game, so you won't know who's who. Um, we've kind of swapped up controllers, so she might be one, I might be one, you guys won't know. But we're going to play with the same character, because I know if I picked Yoshi, you guys would know it's me. I know you would know it's me. So... We're going to hop in and see how things are going. And I'm going to keep an eye on the chat because there's a whole bunch of people here. Wooly says so far so good. And Pecan and Kevin and Ro Robert and Ange. I see John here. Olga is here. Lots of people are here. Matthew Boyd says don't forget to let her win. Uh, yeah. He doesn't have to let me. I don't have to let you win? No. Okay. Because I can just beat you. Okay. So we are both going to play as Yoshi, so that uh, you guys won't know who's who. And uh... Okay, we're both playing as Red Yoshi, apparently. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, let's pick our cards, babe, and then we will um, hop in and start racing and see who's who. We will be giving away some games tonight, as we always do, so we'll look forward to that as well. I'm going to get like a big old monster truck. Is there a bigger tire? No. There we go. And I don't want the airplane. I just want... I just gave away who I am. So now we're going to go back and we're going to swap up again. <laughs> and we're going to do this again. <laughs> All right. Where are we going back in? Okay, now we're both red Yoshis, and now we're going to build vehicles and not talk while we build them. But then we are uh, we won't take too long. We'll get right into the racing. We have eight people here so far. Thank you, everyone, for coming out. I think it will be a lot of fun tonight. And if not, well, we tried it once, and we'll see how it goes. Hey, Aurora. Aurora is here, and I see Ange, and Pecan, Wooly, and so far the audio's fine, everyone says, so that's good. Okay. We're going to do these four races, uh, only because we've no, we don't have any trophy on this one. I've had this game for years and still don't have a gold trophy on every cup, so we're going to see how this one goes. But of course, we'll need four first place finishes from somebody in order to get the full three stars. All right, so you can pick your favorite, left or right. Who do you think is going to win? Left or right? And I'll see. And we'll see who picks right. But we won't, like, you got to pick and then you got to stay with it. You can change after each race until after the third race. After the third race, going into the fourth race. You cannot choose anymore. But you can pick at any point during the race, you can decide who you wanna who you wanna back. And we'll see who's right. And my wife's pretty good at Mario Kart. I, I like to think I'm pretty good. I'm not really all that great at Mario Kart. I'm not like a professional, but I'm not terrible either. She's right up there with me. We have very competitive races in general, so. It'll be interesting to see who wins and who loses. <laughs> the big thing will be not talking while I race because I'll want to say something, but that'll definitely give away. Um, it'll give away what position I'm in, or what position she's in, or what's happened to me, or what's happened to her. All right, and just going left. Pecan is going right. That's it. Hey, Carmelo. Carmelo is in the chat. Carmelo, we're picking uh, which racer you think is going to win. And we are both red Yoshis, and so you won't really know who's who, actually. 
but so far I've seen a someone pick left. I've seen somebody pick right. And that's about it. I think we've only had two so far. Yeah, Carmelo, my wife's with me. She's very intent on playing, so she's not saying anything. Mostly because I think she's also afraid of giving up um, of giving up which uh, which which side she's on, whether she's the left side or the right side. But I'm not going to tell you until the very, very end who was who. So far we've got a pick for left and we've got a pick for right. And uh, looking at the screen, I would say neither one of us is doing particularly well. We've already hit double digits for people tonight. We will have some giveaways coming up, so stay tuned. And then on uh, Saturday during our stream, we will have an eShop gift card. Just a little one, nothing big, but we will have one that you guys can enter to win. Because more and more people have been saying, I would like to have... Um, Nintendo giveaways as opposed to Xbox giveaways. So that's fine. Oh, Carmelo with a big donation. Carmelo donated $20. Sweet. Sweet. She's very soft. She doesn't talk. We were setting it up prior to, to playing, and she was like, you talk way too loud, and I talk normal. So I moved really far away from the mic, and I put the mic like right in front of her, and now she doesn't say anything. Carmelo, thank you so much for your donation. All right. One race down. I've got somebody who says left and Pecan's picked right and no one else has picked either one. So let's move on to Piranha Plant Slide. I'm tempted to do this every couple weeks, switching up the games. We both have different strengths and weaknesses when it comes to multiplayer games. I can tell you right now, if we played uh, Mario Party, I would lose. Uh, I was hoping to play Mario Party tonight, and it wasn't downloaded on my Switch, which, uh, Carmelo, you'll understand now the reason why um, Stadia is so great. Lindsay picked left. Hey, Vlad. So Lindsay picked left. So we've got two left picks, and we've got one right pick. And uh, I think the, the left side finished second last race. The right side finished eighth. Um, and it looks like it's very much the opposite right now for this race. So it's anyone's game on who they pick. And I'll let you guys guess at the end who was who, and we'll have some fun with that as well. Okay. Twelve people already out. This is already better than my, uh, my Pokemon Snap screen from last night. So that's, that's pretty good already. Big reasons why my wife should probably just stream more. Stream more often. Although she's still not saying anything. Are you just too intently playing? <laughs> yeah, I'm concentrating. You're concentrating? <laughs> she's concentrating. That's this why is, she's not This playing. isn't the character or the card that I would usually pick. No, this is actually not the character or card I would normally pick for uh, Mario Kart either. I have a different character and kart combination for Mario Kart, as does my wife. So this is kind of... Um, this is kind of foreign territory in terms of who we're playing as and what carts we're using. It's not normal for either of us. And in Mario Kart, it actually matters uh, when, you, when you're looking at weight, when you're looking at acceleration, top end speed. All of that actually matters to how you play. Um, some people will tell you it doesn't. It definitely does. What I'm more embarrassed about is the fact that both of us on 150cc can't finish 1-2 on every race. We should be finishing 1-2. But we're not. Who's winning? Vlad, wow, that's the fun of it. Uh, we, I'm, we're not saying who's who. I think we've had two picks for the person on the left to win the whole thing. Not to win the whole thing, maybe, but to win between the two of us. And we've had one pick for the person on the right. So, um, oh, you're playing with your wife today. Yes, Vlad, I am playing with my wife today. And Vlad says, hi, Adam's wife. Hello. My wife's name's Alyssa. In case you just want to call her by her real name. It's just Alyssa. <laughs> Carmelo. Yeah. The one thing is I turned up the... Uh, I did have to turn up the sensitivity of the mic. Uh, just because my wife does speak a lot softer. And we are sharing a mic for this. So you're most definitely going to hear the clickety-click of the controllers. That's just inevitable. When I stream on my own, um, I actually put a pillow on my lap. And I put the controller under the pillow. 
So when I click, you guys don't hear it as much. But tonight I had to mess with some stuff just for, uh, for audio purposes. And you're going to hear the click. Carmelo says, um, listening to those controller sounds, no wonder Nintendo won't cover your repair. <laughs> yes. Carmelo just said Mrs. Raffle. That's all he said. It's Alyssa, Carmelo. Mrs. Raffle is my mom. I'm not, not a Raffle. <laughs> no, she's not. She's very, uh, she's very modern. She didn't take my last name when we got married. So she's very much a Burnett, and I'm very much a Raffle, and that's how it works. Um... Nintendo, or Carmelo, you said something about Adam is worth the price of admission. Well, thanks, Carmelo. I think Carmelo's got more reviews coming up on gamesreviews.com in the coming week, probably, Carmelo. Within a week, you're going to have a review of Octopath Traveler. He's been doing a lot of Stadia coverage for us. He's also got a couple contests going on right now on Twitter, so be sure to follow Carmelo and, uh, and check out what he's been doing. I have two contests going on right now. One is for a copy of Story of Seasons, Pioneers of Olive Town, thanks to XC Games. If you head over to my channel and find episode 83 of Story of Seasons, you'll get all the details in that episode. We will be giving away the code, um, not live because I pre-record those episodes, but we will be giving away uh, the code for that game when I publish episode 100. Um, so there's still a little bit of time. I think we're on episode 90. I want to say we're on episode 95 right now. So if you hop over to episode 83, you can find all the details for that contest. The other contest is a $60 Amazon gift card giveaway. That one's courtesy of myself and gamesreviews.com. That's actually pinned to my Twitter profile, and I believe it might be in the description box of this video as well. So if you want to enter that uh, to potentially win a $60 Amazon gift card, please click that link. And other links you'll find is a link to Patreon. No need, of course, to uh, to donate to the channel. Um, but if you want to, that's where you can do that. And then there's also a link to Discord, which is completely free. And I'd love to have you come on over there and talk about games and a bunch of other things. Okay. Um, I don't remember the standings after the last race, but uh, obviously person on the right is in first, person on the left is in third, and it's really anybody's game at this point. Uh, but after this race, I need your guesses on who's who. Hey, Joash. Joash is stopping by to watch. Joash is, of course, I've mentioned many times, uh, one of my many brothers who, uh, who also loves to play games and stuff like that, so glad to have Joash here. Um, after after this uh, race, start putting in your bets on who's who in this situation, whether uh, I'm on the left or on the right, or my wife's on the left or the right, and then we'll ultimately see who wins. <laughs> Carmelo, I'm not going to tell you whether that was me with mushrooms or not. But I see what you're doing there, trying to find out. That's cheeky. Uh, hey, Taylor. How are you? Taylor is in the chat. Taylor, one of my uh, awesome Patreon supporters. That's Kiz Carmelo. Thanks to both of you. Who else came in? Lord of Vivek. It says Mario. Uh, yeah, no one's Mario, but... Oh, you're picking Mario to win? Okay, we're on to the last race. Uh, go ahead. Carmelo saying Adam's on the right. And that's it. <laughs> Carmelo says, so Adam, how much is your wife charging you right now? She's just staring at me. I don't think she's charging me anything. This is a freebie. This is a freebie. I'll have some work to do, I'm sure, later to, to make up for it. But uh, I love to do this. I really do enjoy streaming. I also like just playing games. And, uh, and my wife does as well. So when we can do them together... In situations like this, for a ha uh, for about 45 minutes or an hour on a Thursday night, um, it is still a lot of fun. And uh, because of all the awesome support tonight, we've got 16 folks checking out the stream. I'm sure we will be doing it again with something more uh, interesting, like perhaps um, Mario Party. And who knows, maybe we'll bust out the Wii U or, or something else and play some old school games. But we'll find out. It'll usually be a Thursday night thing if it's ever going to happen again. 
but I think there's enough interest here to do it. Uh, so, and just going with the left, as the person that's going to win or the person that's me? Uh, Robert says Adam's on the left. Taylor says Adam's on the left. Yeah, don't just assume that whoever I am is the better racer. Like, my, my wife and I are both accomplished or uh, main i mean based on what's happened on on this uh circuit unaccomplished mario kart racers maybe 150 cc was a bad way it's been a long time since either of us have played any mario kart not yet carmelo come on not yet nah you know what that's a good idea throw those hashtags in the chat you know what to do and we will pick uh, a winner in just a little bit We've got so many, I've got so many Xbox codes to give away, I don't even know what to do with them all. They're just piling up. It's both for me. I hate Rainbow Road. Rainbow Road? Yeah. Yeah, Rainbow Road's the worst. All of them, I hate them all. All Rainbow Roads are I the worst? I think this one is my favorite out of all of them, but I still <laughs> My favorite Rainbow Road is um, Mario Kart 64 Rainbow Road, I think is the best one. Oh no, I don't know which one's which. So Carmelo says that I was on the... Carmelo, where are you at? Did you say I was on the right, Carmelo? I don't know which one I am and which one you are at 4 or 5. Oh yeah, that's a good point. We are both <laughs> Red Yoshi and we don't know who's who in this situation. <laughs> we didn't think that through. Because uh, it doesn't tell you which one's player 1 and which one's player 2. I'm going to assume that I am player... I am number 5 on this list. I think you beat me. I don't know. What do you guys think? Who won? Like, in terms of points, who got more points? The person on the left or the person on the right? So, Carmelo, you're wrong. My wife was on the right, and I was on the left. If you go to the next screen, you know. It might tell us on the next screen who's who. I was on the left. My wife was on the right. We're going to mix it up and do it again. And do another circuit. Mm -hmm. And then we might jump into a little battle mode for a little while as well. Ange says Mario Kart 8. Kurt's with a K, Ange. Not with a C. Okay. Uh, Vlad said he thought I was on the right. Just playing with our minds. No, I was on the left. <laughs> Carmelo just does the um, um, does. emoji. Yeah, so we don't know who's who. This was a mistake. So next time we won't both pick the exact same character. because I picked Red Yoshi first. You did pick Red Yoshi first. I wasn't looking at her screen, but she did pick Red Yoshi first. And then I picked Red Yoshi and we don't know who's who, but I'm almost positive you beat me. I did really well on race one and two, and then I finished like eighth on Rainbow Road, and I finished like seventh or eighth on the the yeah, Fire Canyon like one. Two and three. Yeah, you you definitely beat me. You were the one on top. All right, we're gonna swap the controllers, and then do this again, Just and we're gonna back do back all the way out. Pardon? Back all the way out. Back all the way out. Okay, let's back all the way out because we gotta switch things up. All right. Nope, I didn't back all the way out. There we go. Okay, let's go back in. Game on with Tony says, remember your wife is right. <laughs> Always. I do. I do remember that my wife is right. Uh, Grand Prix. And which one do you want to do this time, do you think? Okay. Okay. Let's do Mario and Luigi. Mario and Luigi? Mm -hmm. Rock, paper, scissors to see who's who? Sure. Okay. Winner's Mario. I won't tell you who wins. Okay. All right. So we're doing Mario and Luigi. Okay. Right wins. I called it, said Pecan. Yeah, right did win. Right did win. But we'll see who wins this time. And I'm thinking it might be me. We'll pick our first winner tonight. And tonight's first winner will be Pecan. Pecan, send me a DM on Twitter. I'll be sure to hook you up probably tomorrow morning. Uh, don't go anywhere, guys. We'll do some more coming up very, very soon. Okay. We had previously agreed to do this once, so we're doing the Triforce Cup. We both want to do this one. Uh, <laughs> um, we have no we have no stars on this one, so 
obviously we've never done well at it or we've actually just never done it at 150 cc but we're about to figure out um we're about to figure out if we're any good at it it's been so long since how long has it been since you played mario kart <laughs> a long time yeah it's been a long time for her or since we she just played. play it with the kids and then we play it on 50 yeah if we play with our kids we play on like 50 cc and as of right now we're more likely to um, play with our kids than we are to play it on our own. Um, I saw Ange, I think, in the chat saying she's going with Luigi as opposed to Mario. So let's see here what's going on. Can I put my controller under the blanket? Is it better <laughs> my wife said she put her controller under the blanket if you didn't hear. And she's hoping it doesn't click as loud anymore. I don't have a pillow nearby, or I'd grab a pillow and try to muffle that, but, uh... Well, it's because I have the old GameCube controller. Oh, yeah, those PD... Uh, the P, not PDP. Uh, no, the Powerade GameCube controllers. They're great little controllers, but they make a lot of noise. They really do make a lot of noise. Yeah, I can actually say that we both got splatted by Bluebird because we did. And no one will know the difference. Okay, we've had one vote for Luigi, uh, and I don't know if we've had votes for anything else, and there's no rails on this track, so I don't dare look down into the chat to figure out what's going on. If there are rails, I feel a little more comfortable doing it, because absolutely worst case scenario, I mean, I'm a fantastic driver, but worst case scenario, I'm going to hit a rail. But in this one, I'm going to go right off the edge, so we've got to focus. Because even if, even regardless of who I was last time, finishing fourth and fifth is kind of embarrassing on Mario Kart. They're losing to the uh, to the AI. That's not great. <clears throat> All right. Let's see what's going on here. Hey, Danny. Danny is in the chat tonight. How are you, Danny? Danny, right now I am playing uh, Mario Kart 8 with my wife. We're not telling anybody who we are. One of us is Mario right now. One of us is Luigi. Uh, you get to guess who's who in this situation. Last time around we finished 4th and 5th. My wife was 4th. I was 5th. We swapped controllers or maybe didn't swap controllers. Who knows? And uh, put on a new uh, race. And we're going to see who can win this time. One of us, Mario, of course. One of us, Luigi. Things are getting intense. I gotta, I gotta think before I. Okay, it's a two-three finish. Two for Mario, three for Luigi. Joe says I've got a power A with hope of playing Sunshine, and remap the buttons to GameCube controls, and you can't remap buttons on it. Yeah, I think you can remap it on the wired, Joash, I think you can remap it on the wired performance design products. GameCube style controller, I think you can redo those ones. But it's wired, it's not wireless. Anne says she loves that course and the Animal Crossing one. I'm a big fan of the Animal Crossing one. Uh, okay. Uh, so Anne is voting Luigi, and I don't think anybody else has voted. Wooly Season says Mario is my wife. Uh, and Danny says I'm doing awesome and sounds fun. Yeah, Danny, take a pick. Who are you who are you rooting for in this tournament? We've one race down, three to go. One of us is Mario, one of us is Luigi, and uh, and we're doing some Mario Kart. And I forget what this cup's called, but we're doing Rainbow Road from the Super Nintendo. I'm, I really do like that they kind of took these old maps from the Super Nintendo. Kind of gave them a modern twist and then put them into Mario Kart 8 Deluxe. I think that was a really brilliant move. But playing Mario Kart 8 Deluxe now is really just making me want to play... Or not play. Is really just making me want Nintendo to launch a Mario Kart 9. At that, at this point, that's all I want. Because officially, we haven't got a new Mario Kart. I mean, unless you count Mario Kart Home Circuit. And I hope Nintendo doesn't. But... That's a different kind of product. We haven't had a traditional Mario Kart game on Switch yet, because technically the uh, the last uh, the last the only Mario Kart traditional Mario Kart game on Switch is a remake of the uh, Wii U one, which is still worth it. Not a lot of folks got to play that game, um, so you know all 
all Wii U remakes I'm okay with. I love to play them again. I, I owned most of them on the Wii U, but a lot of people didn't. So I don't really have an issue with them going back to the uh, going back to the vault and taking these games out, dusting them off, and re-releasing them. But uh, I do want a new Mario Kart. Although we're getting a new Mario Golf, so maybe that's going to tide me over for a long time because I absolutely love Mario Golf titles, and we will be playing that on the channel, and I will be playing that with many of you. So. Make sure you send over your friend codes, and I will be sure to add you so we can play Mario Golf. Speed Golf. I'm very excited about Speed Golf. Alright. We are both on our final laps now, and uh, um, I don't think neither of us are doing as good as we would like, but that's okay. It's all about having some fun, and I think we're both having fun. Interesting. A uh, five finish for Mario, a six finish for Luigi. Robert says Adam is Luigi. Taylor says I always go Daisy and Luigi, so I gotta go with my Luigi guy on this one. Vlad says Luigi always finishes second. And Josh says I used an 8 bit Ditto wireless adapter that has GameCube port with the original controller. Now it shows up as a Pro Controllers and the buttons are remappable. That's interesting. Danny picked Luigi. It seems like Luigi is the popular pick here, although I see a couple Marios. Wooly's got a Mario, and uh, Pecan's got a Mario. And she says Luigi's kicking butt. That's a lot of picks for Luigi. We're not winning the stars. No, we're definitely not winning the stars, that's for sure. Which course is this, even? Which one is this <laughs> one? I wasn't paying attention. I was looking and pressing A at the same time. Anybody in the chat know which actual course this is? I think I play this, uh, I mean we both, like I mentioned we don't play Mario Kart often, but I feel like when we do, we rarely play this cup because I don't even recognize this race to name it. Like a lot of other courses I can like at least place it, like I can be like, hey this is like a Bowser one or a Rainbow Road one, which is quite obvious. Or this was from the 3DS game, I can't even place this game. Okay, here we go. Carmelo's picking Mario to win it all. So I think that puts us maybe in a tie now. Three and three. Three for Mario, three for Luigi. And it's competitive. We're competitive people. I'm surprised actually there's so much love. Why do people love Luigi so much? I'm not a fan. I'm generally not a fan of Mario either. I, mean, I wouldn't play as Mario or Luigi. Um, but we made this all random. We decided we were going to be Mario and Luigi. And then we did Paper, Scissors, Rock to see who would be who. And that was that. So neither of us are playing... Again, neither of us are playing a character that we wanted. And we spent a grand total of like 30 seconds building our vehicle. So n neither of us are playing with with characters or carts that we normally would. Carmelo just says, uh, I'm that kind of guy. Because no one likes Luigi. <laughs> I mean, does anybody like Luigi? I don't... Luigi's the worst. Well, it's funny. When I play Mario Party, I always play as Luigi. But when I play Mario Kart, I never play as Luigi. I mean, when I play anything Mario-related, I play as Yoshi. Except for Mario Golf, I don't think I play with Yoshi just because he's not very good. I mean, he's all around, but uh, at least on Toadstool Tour, when you could, like, upgrade... On Toadstool Tour, Tour, when you could upgrade your characters to, like, Star Mode, I mean, there were just better characters than Yoshi that could hit farther and could hit straight. Like, the big thing about Yoshi was he could hit straight... And uh, he always usually connected with the ball right on the center. So it was easier to take a good shot, but... I mean, it's Mario Golf. It's not hard to take good shots in Mario Golf. 
So, of course, I was going to pick Mario, who doesn't have a fade or, or anything, and he hits it straight as well and can hit it farther. So, and just I have a Yoshi Wii gamepad. I do have some Yoshi controllers. At least I did. Carmelo says, so wait, Adam, you're Mario. Uh, I'm not going to tell you who I am. Although, I think that was race three, so now you pick who's who. Uh, in terms, of, I know a lot of you have picked Luigi's going to win or Mario's going to win, but now you got to pick who is Luigi and who is Mario, and we'll see who's right. And put more hashtags in the chat. We'll pick another winner in just a second. John Lugizamo gave me a crush on Luigi in the Mario Bros. movie. <laughs> I've never seen that Mario Bros. movie. I have, um, I mean, I've seen it like in memes, and I've seen clips, and it looks absolutely terrible, but I don't think I've ever actually seen that movie. And based on what people tell me, I don't need to see it. <laughs> I don't need to see it ever. Although I'm ex very excited for the new animated Mario movie. Unless that was a hoax and I've just embarrassed myself. I don't think it was a hoax though. I do think it's a real thing. All right. I have no idea where the, what the stats are uh, for this race. I want to say just based on a first place finish last race, Mario might be in first place between the two of them, but uh, mm -hmm. I actually don't know. Two and four. Oh, two and four? Who's two? Mm -hmm. Okay, so according to my wife, Mario's in second overall, and Louise's in fourth. Sunshine Nickerson says, Hey Adam, uh, I couldn't send you an email. Did I, did I get you, Sunshine? Did I get you on Twitter, though, or no? Let me know. We can figure it out after. Uh, or you can drop your email in the chat, and I can send you an email. We'll go that way. It's possible you sent me an email and it went into my spam or something as well. Or, I mean, I could have made the argument I accidentally deleted it. I wouldn't have done it on purpose, but I do from time to time mass delete email. So it's, I guess it's possible that I deleted it. I apologize, but uh, send me another one because I know I got to hook you up. Okay, so in this race, doesn't look like things are going well for Mario, but things seem to be going very well for Luigi, and this could ultimately decide who comes out on top at the very end. I think we're going to hop into a little battle next because battle is uh, much more exciting. And we both have our own strengths and weaknesses when it comes to battle. So we'll tell you exactly who we are when we do battle mode. Um, okay. Danny said, I actually made my boyfriend watch the Mario Bros. movie last night and he hated it. <laughs> you still enjoy it though, Danny. Oh, that's interesting. I've never heard someone tell me they enjoy the Mario movie. Uh, Kevin is with the hashtag and hashtag Danny hashtag. Yeah, okay. Few results. So, <laughs> Carmelo says, wow, what a comeback, Adam. Yes, I was Mario. Alyssa was Luigi. Um, and I did have a heck of a comeback because I started that third lap in seventh place. You suck at the beginning of every single one, and then you always come back. I do. I'm the, I'm the comeback kid when it comes to Mario Kart. I don't know why. I thrive. I'm always doing well at the beginning, and then you come back. Yeah, because I would play with my brother-in-law, like Alyssa's brother. I'd play with him a lot, and he'd always be up in front and always, almost always get screwed by a blue shell at some point. So I'm like, well, what's the benefit of being in first place for the first two laps? Really nothing. Like, you just end up getting yeah, yourself in trouble. Yeah, because you do it on purpose. I do it on purpose. No, you do not. I do it on... I, to everyone in the chat, I swear I do it on purpose. I, I hang back, no, fall off the edge a couple times, kind of fall some positions, and then just drive right to the front. Carmelo says he knew it. Uh, so Robert said I was confused before picking Luigi, but I'm saying Adam was Luigi. I'm, I wasn't, Robert. I was Mario on this one. I know there's a delay between what we're playing in the chat, so that's to be uh, understood. And Per Perateria, hey, how are you? All right, we're going to jump into some battle mode before we decide to close things down for tonight. Uh, and we'll let you know who we are 
because uh, it'll be much more competitive. Do we go back for battle mode? No? Oh, we pick our players first? Yeah. Okay, let's hop into battle. I'm going with Yoshi because that's what I do. And I always go light blue Yoshi. It's the way I like to roll. Carmelo is good, Danny. He, he, knows, he knows who to pick. All right. Um, I actually liked... No. What are we doing? I don't know what we're doing yet. Does it make you decide what we're going to do? How about if we do random? We're going to go random. Because Alyssa asked what we were going to do. Because she would pick her... She's smart enough to pick her car based on... Based on what we might be doing. Adam has a terrible hate for Luigi. Was it obvious, Carmelo? My hate for Luigi? So I want to give a quick shout out again to Carmelo for that generous donation right off the top of today's stream. $20. Thank you so much, Carmelo, for that once again. Now log off and get back to work because you owe me some reviews. I think. A couple at least. Robert, Vlad. Okay. We are going to do um, random for three minutes. No teams, eh? No teams? I don't know what that means. That means that there's there's no teams. It's every man for himself. Oh. So that it won't pick any of the ones that are... Well, it will pick some of the multiplayer ones, but you'll score points based on whether you win or lose to the grand scheme of things. Uh, three minutes, normal computers, all vehicles. Uh, is there five different ones? Yeah. Okay, five rounds. One of the advantages of being Luigi is that you can do the Luigi stare. <laughs> I'll let you pick which one we do first. Woohoo Town. Woohoo Town? Okay, let's pick Woohoo Town. Did I make it? Goldeneye, you definitely made it. We are still going strong. I'm going to pick another winner while this loads up. Our next winner tonight of an Xbox code is Danny. Danny, send me a DM on Twitter and I will be sure to hook you up with your prize. Yeah, Carmelo knew what was going on the whole time. And Carmelo puts things in the chat to try to trick me into like telling him. He was like, Good using your mushrooms, Adam. When I used mushrooms, I almost said thanks. And I was like, oh, wait. I can't tell him what we're doing. All right, first up, three minutes of balloon battle. Oh, no. It's not balloon battle. It is uh, bombs. And uh, I've never been very good at playing the bomb courses, but we'll see what happens here. I'm most definitely uh, the person. I'm Yoshi. I don't have to say which side I'm on. I'm Yoshi. Alyssa is Gold Peach. Is that what that is? Alyssa's Metal Peach, not Gold Peach. I have, um... Do you have any points yet? Me neither. And I have no bombs either, so this is not good. I have no points, no bombs. And, uh... That's not great. I got a point. It's never good when you're chased by someone who just got hit by a bomb because they're invincible, so I just got hit. Okay, I got 1.4 balloons left. I mean, you got all your balloons still, right? Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, I see you. Oh, that's not, oh, someone else snagged the hit. Oh, I'm out of bombs. Why am I chasing someone with no bombs? <laughs> oh, man. All right, let's see here. Um, <laughs> I think we're both having a terrible go here. I still only have one point. I don't know if you have any points yet. Oh, my goodness. Okay, I hit. I've got three points now, but I also only have three balloons left. All right, I found Bowser, and I'm about to... Uh, Try to finish him off for the night. There he is. Bowser's done. I got four, but I don't have the crown, which means I'm not in first. Bowser's back. Oh, you get to come back if you run yeah, out of balloons. Yeah, you just lose your points. You lose all your points or like half your points? Are you chasing me? I don't know. Oh, I thought you were chasing me. <laughs> oh, look at all these ones. Oh, I've got the crown now, so I'm doing all right. I mean, I shouldn't get cocky, but... 
It's never good when you hit something and you get like stalled out because that's a good opportunity for someone to just come up right behind you. Someone took my crown. Okay, I took one and hit. Oh wow, I got seven. But now I think, um, no, oh dang. Come back, I only have one, I only have one. Two seconds, one second. All right, I won that round. I got the crown. Uh, what's going on? There's so much stuff going on in the chat. I missed it all. Go Yoshi says Ange. Vlad's going for Metal Peach. <laughs> oh man. Everyone's talking about the vaccines they've got. I don't have mine yet. Although I'm eligible to get one. I haven't done it. I should do it though. And then my wife is also eligible. So we can both go get our vaccines and be done with it. I'm going to pick uh, Battle Course 1. Our next one all right fantastic we'll do another giveaway coming up here guys so just put the hashtag back down in the chat danny also picks peach that's two picks for peach and only one pick for me so people have no faith in me apparently that's fine sunshine said he got the first dose of the covid covid19 vaccine the other day nice yeah and you picked uh you picked a winning team i don't know what we're doing this now what is this Oh, it's Coin Rush. Okay. We're just going for coins at this point. I would say I'm usually pretty good at Coin Rush. Um, but I'm not sure how I'll do at Teamed Coin Rush. Because I don't know if I've ever done Teamed Coin Rush before. Oh, I just used the feather and jumped on top of someone and stole their coins. Well, that's fun. Why did their coins disappear? What do you mean, why did they disappear? Like it just disappeared in front of you? Yeah. I don't know, how many coins do you got? Um, I just saw someone with like a whole stack of coins. Where's all the coins? Alright, I've got some weapons now. Which means I can start... Alright, I got four. And here is... Link's got a whole stack of coins. Alright. Man, you got three, five, that's six. Okay, here's someone with some coins. I'm gonna try, where'd they go? Man, I'm dangerous running through the middle like that. I'm gonna hit myself. I've got eight and I still don't have the crown. You yeah, have eight coins and not have a crown. There we go. I got a crown now. I know what's going to happen. I'm going to look down at the chat to read it because I'm like, oh, I bet you someone has said something. And then I'm going to uh, miss something and get hit. I know that's what's going to happen. So I feel like I shouldn't uh, neglect the chat so much. Dang it. Oh, well, I was missed. Like for coin rush yeah. no it's it can be crazy if you're not like you always got to be moving on this course or you're gonna get yourself in trouble i was thinking right now i was just doing a hawk and i thought you know what item i miss the item block like the fake item block that was the best because you could hide that oh no no oh no i lost like all my coins how many do you got not very many. Oh, there's some. Alright. Uh, I lost a bunch of my coins. That's disheartening. Oh, and then I missed that item box, too. We have 14 seconds left on this one. And then I'll see what's happening in the chat. There is something happening. I know that for sure. Oh. Well, i got to circle around and get those coins. There's going to be a ton just lying around here. Nope. Seven. I didn't have the most, but that's uh, that's okay. Golden Eyes Team Yoshi and just Team Yoshi, and that's it. There's two Team Yoshi's and so far two Team Pink Gold Peach. And you never know. You can earn a lot of points in battle mode really quickly. So be sure. Vlad says Waluigi. Well, I mean, you can be Waluigi. I think he's probably in here. Our next winner tonight will be. Uh, you can pick Alyssa. Our next winner. Hey, homie Drew. 
How are you? Our next winner tonight will be Goldeneye. Goldeneye, send me a DM on Twitter. I'll be sure to hook you up. Winner. Oh, this one sucks. This one's great for the coin one. Lunar Colony. Alyssa says Lunar Colony is great for the coin run, but who knows what we're doing. All right. Yeah, let's keep cheering on Yoshi, because I think I'm in first, maybe. Am I in first? I am. I'm in first. Nice job to both of us, says homie Drew. Well, that's very nice of you. You don't make friends being nice, homie Drew. Come on. Pick a side. Don't sit on the fence. I don't know what we're doing. Oh, Bloom Battle. This is not a bad one for Bloom Battle, but it's very wide open. Like, there's a lot of room to maneuver in this one. I have a feeling like I'm just going to be, like, in trouble. Like, I'm getting really cocky about how well I'm doing. And it's just going to all, like... It's going to slowly, like, fade away. You know what I mean? Oh, I'm hitting walls. Get those hashtags in the chat. We're going to keep picking winners until we are finished here, which will be after this battle run. So, uh, after this battle run, we will be calling it a night. And we will... I don't know. Would you do this again, Alyssa? Kind of putting you on the spot, I guess. She says maybe she would do it again. I think we can do it again. I don't know. Somehow I have three kills already, but I don't think I've done anything but throw green shells randomly into the middle and hit people. So I would not call it a skill by any means. I'm going to call it all pure dumb luck. I mean, the, the big thing in this one is just making sure you hold on to your balloons. Because you get, like, five hits. Because the second you lose all your balloons, I think you lose half your points. So unless you can round up, like, a ton of... Unless you can get, like, a ton of, of hits so that when you do lose half, you're still doing better than most people. Uh, it can really get you in trouble. So preserving those balloons is a big deal. And I've got... See, I'm hitting random people and I'm not doing anything. That fires nicely. You just kind of spray that all over the place. What's wrong? Bowser hit me. Alright, well. I have now a personal vendetta against Bowser. And he got hit by somebody else. See, green shells, I feel like you shouldn't let go of them unless you have something better to use. And I do. I got fire. So I'm going to get into the middle and then just start spraying this fire everywhere in hopes that I hit... Oh, crap a -roni. I'm down to two balloons, and we got 39 seconds left. I'm going to be really, really upset if I, uh, if I die. Right now I got the crown, and I'm feeling pretty good about it. But, you know, I can get hit twice in 28 seconds, I think. That's probably something that could happen. I think I'm just having a good run, babe. Pardon? <laughs> Are you getting upset? I can't get upset. It's all fun and games. Oh, no. I lost my crown. Losing's not fun. Losing's not fun? Are you sure? Yes. Hey, Goldeneye with a 399 super chat. Thank you so much. Wait for it. I didn't get him, Goldeneye. Uh, homie Drew says I need to get this game. It's been on my list. Yeah, the problem is it's like four years old or three years old and it still costs 80 bucks. So they had a sale, Goldeneye, probably in Alberta too. Uh, they had a sale for um, $25 off Nintendo games at most retailers like Best Buy and Shoppers Drug Mart and stuff like that, which I assume you have all of... I know you have Best Buy out in Alberta. I'm sure you have everything else. Hey, Danny. Danny with a $1.49 super chat. Thank you so much. And an awesome unicorn. Oh, it's not a super chat. It's a super sticker. Uh, let's do... Did we do this one? Sweet, sweet kingdom? We're gonna do sweet, sweet kingdom. Yeah, good job, Golden Danny, says Vlad, for sure. Let's pick another winner, just because Goldeneye and Danny were so generous. And the next one will be Robert. Robert, send me a DM. I'll be sure to hook you up. Um, the wait for it was supposed to show up before the sticker. Oh, I see what you're saying. I thought you were talking about when I said I was gonna go get Bowser back. Hey, Danny does a $5 super sticker. Thank you so much, Danny. I love that fox. A lot of people use that fox, and a lot of people use the... What do you call this, Alyssa? 
What is that? A gourd? That's not gourd. Is it a is it a pear? I can't see that. An avocado? Is that an avocado? It says fist bump. I think it's an avocado. Okay, I've heard people say it was a pear. I called an avocado. I mean, I called a pear. Alyssa calls it an avocado. Danny with the unicorn super sticker. Or no, Danny. Yeah, Danny, two stickers. She realized that was you twice, Danny. A unicorn sticker and then the awesome little fox. Thank you, Danny. Thank you, Carmelo. Thank you, GoldenEye, so, so much. What does the fox say? It says GoldenEye, yeah. Haven't heard that song in a while. And she says she loves the unicorn, so do I. And everybody's saying congratulations to Robert. GoldenEye says he bought his copy through Kijiji. It's a good copy. It's a good game. Not a good copy. I'm sure your copy's good too, but it's a good game. The thing about Mario Kart is no matter... Oh, we're playing Shine Thief, so I want that Shine. Uh, the thing about Mario Kart is you can bust it out, like, all the time. Like, it's it's always the right time to play Mario Kart. Especially when you have people over. Not right now because of COVID, but I mean, when you could have people over. It's always a good time to play Mario Kart. So it's, it's, a, it's an easy purchase because you know you'll be using it quite a bit. Mario Kart, and I found Mario Party is actually very similar as well. You kind of just know that when you buy those games that you're going to get your money worth. What's happened? I don't even know what was happening. I won. That's what happened. <laughs> All right. So, Alyssa, is that the total standings right now? Yeah. Okay. So, this <laughs> is what I was talking about. You can rock one game and just rack, rock it right up the leaderboards. Because I was doing, I want to say, fairly well. I think I've been in first place since we started doing this battle. And then Alyssa grabbed that shine, and I don't think you'd lost it. She didn't lose it, and now she's in first place by nine points. So all the people that were picking uh, Peach to win, probably not a bad pick at this point. Is there one more? Oh, we yeah. Have the, uh... We have one more round of Cops and Robbers, yeah. or Renegades, or whatever it's called. No, bo no problem, Robotic Richard Simmons. So sorry for showing up late. How's the, the stream? The Dragon one. The Dragon one? Yeah, that's my favorite one okay. for the Cops and Robbers. Have you been enjoying the stream? Okay. Yeah. She's been enjoying it. She's She doesn't want to say that she enjoyed it, but I think she'll be back maybe next Thursday. Next Thursday. Or on two Thursdays, maybe. I won't push my luck. We'll be playing Mario Party next time. I think. Because I think we can do 15 rounds or 10 rounds in an hour. Right? Is it 10 rounds for an hour? Yeah. I think we can do 10 rounds for an hour. So we are, next time, Alyssa's going to come on the stream. And she'll talk more next time. Guaranteed. She's a little nervous this time. Um, you're dodging the law and I'm catching you. So watch out. Oh, this will actually determine who wins this thing. So this is for, technically for all the marbles. Everything else we've done doesn't matter. If um, if my team wins, I will beat Alyssa. And if uh, if her team wins, she will beat me in battle. How many points do you get? I don't know how many points you get. I guess it doesn't necessarily. I'm behind you by how many? Three? You're at 29. I feel like I'm at 26. I mean, you're the only one that's left alive, so... Oh, and... No! 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 Yes! <laughs> I had her lined up and I missed. Or she jumped over me or something. I don't... I only got two points, Alyssa. Nope. Oh! Uh, that's the final standings. Uh, I beat Alyssa by one point. So I think what happened was, you know, overall tonight, I think she won the first race and the second race. You won both races? Or both Grand Prix? No. Did you win the first Grand Prix? I don't know. She won the first Grand Prix. I won the second Grand Prix. And then I won our our battle mode uh, by one point. And that will likely do it. I think that's going to be it for tonight, guys. Thank you so much for stopping by. If you did win a code for an Xbox game tonight, please send me a DM on Twitter. I would love to get that to you. Uh, be sure to check out the channel tomorrow morning at 9 a.m. There'll be a new Story of Seasons episode. And at noon, there'll be a new Pokemon Snap episode. And perhaps a Colonists episode in the afternoon. I don't know how far I'll get. <laughs> Wooly says, now you're sleeping on the couch tonight. <laughs> uh, it might be true. She's laughing, so that <laughs> might actually be true, Wooly. I might be on the couch. Golden Knight says, Team Yoshi. Ange says, nice wins. Homie Drew says, close standings. Josh said, good night. Yeah. 
So thanks everyone. Be sure to check out the channel tomorrow morning for all of those videos. Adam's in the doghouse. <laughs> but I do thank you guys for coming out and for supporting tonight. We're going to do this again, I think. Yes, you're going to do it again. She nods. She will do it again. And we are going to play Mario Party next time. And technically, guys, with the new update for Mario Party, we do have room for two more people. So if anybody is really wanting to play Mario Party and is pretty flexible with when we do it, let me know by sending me a DM on Twitter. We'll find maybe a couple more people to join us in some Mario Party, and we'll give that a go. Until next time, everyone, thanks for watching, and we'll talk again real soon. See ya. Bye.